at you with yard selling. This is my favorite way to source for my store. Um, I absolutely love it. It's so much fun just to go on the hunt and um, you get a bargain. People just want to let stuff go on the low low so always makes my day. I got off of work super early in the a.m. I already saw one on the way to Starbucks so I, I had to stop. I tried to get some footage but I get very like very nervous I got some super cute stuff already I got this little shirt I got this gorgeous little vintage dress look how pretty that is I'll give you guys a better view in the haul but just for right now I got the notorious Nike flare leg I got a little mini skirt I got this little dress. This might just be for me because I love the green tones of it. I got this blue dress and then I got this dress, but I got all those items for $5. So already off to a good start. telling you guys I get off pretty early in the morning so every Saturday I have my cash in my bag ready to go on some yard sales and if you guys are sleeping on yard sales this is your sign to go out and hit the yard sales in your town because there's gold out there you guys I recently hit the gold mine on one so I had to share this haul with you guys um where do I want to get started okay I picked up this cutie I love yard sales because people let stuff go so darn cheap. So I got this cute little vintage one piece lingerie, a little flare on the bottom. So freaking cute, absolutely adorable, love this. It's absolutely gold. I got this like mint green. It kind of has a stone wash to it. Do you see that? Shoulder pads, it goes down. Do you see that detail? It's like a mermaid cut dress, but it has like this little extra piece of fabric to tie in these very adorable little buttons. Ooh, so cute with these buttons. I'm absolutely obsessed. It fits like a freaking glove. The only thing is that it has stains on it. It has one right there and then I think one on the very bottom but since it's stone washed i'm gonna put the lightest little drip of like a little speck of bleach and see if it will kind of still give the stone wash feel to it i don't know guys i might be pushing the limits on this one but it's so freaking cute not to try and save this buddy and if it was at the thrift store full price for like eight nine dollars i wouldn't have gotten it but it was only 50 cents so yeah, it's worth the try. Since I am on the dress little run right now, I'm gonna just go ahead and kill this one. Look how freaking adorable this is. Super 70s, it has these long old ties. It was like very bunched up, but you can do like so much with this beauty. Like you can, you can get crazy with it. It's a full maxi length. Check out that fabric. Isn't that gorgeous? Absolutely obsessed with this dress. I'm gonna have to rock it once before. I, oh, I got hooked in my hair. I'm gonna have to rock this beauty first before I let it go, but you yeah, guys, 50 cents again for this beauty. So freaking good. In 
like decor and vintage and glassware and then I see the clothing and bins I'm like heck yeah so I get out of my car and I notice you know those like moving boxes that like professionals do and they have the rod so you just like hook the hangers it had a bunch of boxes like that I was like oh shoot I went through it this lady's closet was so epic it was actually I started talking to these three little old ladies it's three little old ladies running this yard sale and I started talking to them. It ended up being one of the ladies' mother's closet and I was like, <laughs> like her style is freaking gold, you guys. I can't even believe all this stuff I found. I was probably there for like a little over an hour, maybe an hour and a half, close to two and this lady's closet was just so epic. She had a bunch of little knits, just perfect for summer. I love this one because look at the little, it's black and it has little floral details. Like this little lady was epic. Multiple things were like already put together. I love that. Like, check this out, you guys. She had this like ready to go in her closet. She has this pinstripe vest with a little tie. She already had her shirt picked out for it. Like. Could you imagine how like stylish this little old lady was? I literally, I cannot, I cannot. I was so freaking in love. Her tops were, I already have them like posted in the shop. This little blue one, it has a little keyhole in the front, a button back, so vintage, so cute. She had this brand new with tags. It's so flipping cute on, I literally cannot. Like, I, I'm so close to keeping this one. This was, oh, I'm in love with this one. It's tied on my arm, so I wasn't able to keep it, but you guys, I'm freaking obsessed with it. I didn't find this at the Little Ladies, but I did get them yard selling. Look how funky. So funky goodness. They're from the same brand piano that I've never seen before, but we have like this like, it gives me Shara Paisley vibes, like the frames with the paintings that our, all of our moms had in the 90s with a little fox cheetah tank. And then you have this like brown with little hints of teal and it's a snap closure that I'm obsessed with. So I got these two for 50 cents. I talked about these pants and I had decided to keep them because I'm so obsessed with them. This little lady's fashion was gold. Look how freaking gorgeous these pants are. Share up goodness, you guys. I found this skirt and I was like, you know what? I wasn't loving it at the yard sale, but I took it with me anyways. And when I put it on, I literally fell in love. It's a denim skirt, but if you look closely, it's like little trims of like a scarf. It's so freaking cute on. I'm obsessed with it. The way that it's like curves and scallops. It's freaking gold. If you guys know Threads Obsess on YouTube, she is, she's the queen of the thrift. And she recently did a video of Sex in the City and one of them was Carrie wearing these like boy boy shorts. So when I came across the brown Corona tropical floral heads, I need these because in the back of my mind, I knew I had this yellow bralette that I've never worn. So I paired them together and it was such a fit. Like I'm gonna have to wear this before I let these go. I found this little tiny, little fake Louis Vuitton. I figured it'd be so cute when I have a little baby and they're like mobbing around with a little mini Louis. Like how cute is that? And then I found this 70s little pinky. Isn't that gorgeous? So I had to pick them up. They're just so freaking cute. I couldn't leave them behind. I just picked these up at a yard sale. You guys, like do not sleep on yard sales. Look how freaking cute these are. I'm obsessed with these little shorts. So to end the video, I'm gonna end with these little old lady shoes because I was so lucky enough to have the same size foot as her because her shoes were so freaking epic, especially her sandals. Like I'll pop up the two that I have posted in the store, but I literally kept four pairs of her shoes because she's just 
so stylish. Like, look at these. They're so freaking cute little sandals. I'm obsessed. And then look, aren't those so cute? I'm freaking like, these are so perfect for summer. They're so freaking cute. I'm in love with this little patchwork flower daisy goodness. Like that is so adorable. I got shoes and boxes. Look how cute these boots are. Brand new boots, still in the wrapping. Like, are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? And the best part was, that I was there so long, I literally touched every piece of fabric in that yard sale because I knew it was such gold. These are just my favorites, you guys. I left with like bags on bags and shoe boxes and bags of shoes, like it was freaking crazy. And I started talking to these ladies. I told them where I work because they go like they're the regulars. All this jazz. At the end of the yard sale, they sold everything to me for $5. I couldn't even tell you that. Basically, like, breaks down everything. Like, if I had to do a guess, like, probably seven to 10 cents each. That means I most likely got these shoes for 10 cents each. That's just freaking unbelievable. It's crazy. So, do not sleep on yard sales, you guys, because they are such freaking gold. The people just want to get it out of the garage or wherever they have it stored. They don't care how much it goes for. They just want to get it out. So beat the thrift. Isn't that so freaking cute? Yep. So I just had to share with you guys. That is my favorite latest source for my Debop shop. It's freaking epic. Anyways, thank you so much for watching. Um, if you liked the video, please consider giving me a thumbs up, subscribe, like, comment, your favorite item. And if you live in a town with bomb yard sales, let a girl know because I will travel. I will travel. <laughs> so yeah, thank you for watching. Bye.